<laughs> hey guys, it's me Tim. I am pumped that you're here because today we got some packages in the mail and I am pretty pumped about them. Let's check out what it is. La la la, 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 la la What could this be? Can't you tell me how to get, how to get to Sesame Street? All right, all right. So let's open up package number one. This is from actually the sponsor of this video, Coyote Provisions. So I am pumped to finally have a sponsor for the channel. Coyote Provisions is an outdoor company in Vermont. They are amazing and make some great gear for just regular Joes or for those who want to go out and do some hiking. So let's check this out. Oh, look at this, man. Even a nice little note. Bro, thanks for all your support. Love your wife in the city. Love ya. Awesome. All right, let's check it out. Let's see what we have here. I have got a new logo patch. Ah. Ah. Hoodie. Let's get rid of that paper. We don't need that. Look at that. With a nice little logo patch hoodie. I will definitely be wearing this. Actually, let's, uh, Let's pause this video so I can wear this new thing from Coyote Provisions. Aren't they awesome? Yes, Coyote Provisions. Yeah, it's pretty great, guys. We're gonna go ahead and try this on, and I will be back here in just a second. All right, I'm back. I got the hoodie on. It feels amazing. It's like I was laying in a bunch of feathers. Anyway, I regress. Check out this hoodie. Check out this label, Coyote Provisions. Look at these orange. Orange is my favorite color. I love the color orange. So yeah, it's great. I love it. I um, also believe like some portion of this purchase is going to uh, COVID-19, people who are helping on the front lines of COVID-19. So please check out KD Provisions, outdoor company, first sponsor of this channel. I'm so thankful. Let's check out to see what else is in those boxes. All right, and we're back. Okay, now we're in the hoodie. All right, thing number two that is in my box. Some Coyote Provision stickers. All right, don't need this box. What is this? Oh, yes. Hey, this is the Canon EOS 1B 35 millimeter DSLR camera. This was like the last professional grade not DSLR, SLR camera that Canon made before going digital with the Canon 5D Mark I. This camera is awesome. I'll be doing a review on this here sometime soon, but this was also in the bag. Huge shout out to Gabe and Cody Provisions. I appreciate you guys. Thanks for being a sponsor on the channel. All right, box number two. Oh, you don't need this. Get this out of there. I am. Just open it up with my hands. Who needs this? All right, more packaging. We don't need that at all. Oh, 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 oh. iPad magic keyboard. Woo, this looks awesome. Let's go ahead and open up. All right, keys, Apple. Oh, look at this. I don't even need my keys for this. A little tab here. Let's go ahead and do an unboxing of this. Oh, that felt sexy. Oh, go ahead and take this off. Oh, another box, keyboard. Let's go ahead and take, figure out what. Oh, I knew it was coming. So I brought my old iPad. This is the version one. This is like the 2019 iPad. The 2021, I'm probably not gonna get because I'm not made out of money. But I read that the keyboard 
for the iPad. Works the same. Ooh, okay. My initial impression is this is pretty heavy for a keyboard, but it feels nice. It feels substantial. All right, this is like that little Apple. Ooh. Okay. Got a nice little Apple logo here. There's no little placement. Oh, this thing is, ooh. That thing is nice. All right. So pretty much all, I guess this is like all their packaging and stuff that's in here. This is like designed by Apple in California. So that's pretty kind of cool. So we're gonna take this box and set this to the side. This is the magic one with the little touchy keyboard here. This thing feels nice. I mean, I don't know. I mean, that's kind of how it opens. That's kind of cool. I do love the little USB thing that they right here. Oh man, so let's take the old iPad. And so this is not the one with a little square opening. So let's hopefully it works well in this. I'm not sure. Oh, that is sexy. Look at that. It's now like, it's like a little floating iPad up in the air. I put it on and the keys are, let me turn this off. So that way you can better see. Oh, I guess the keys only light up when the iPad is on. So I guess it's like the pass through power through this thing. It feels nice. It's, it, it is, wow, this is, okay, so this is kind of crazy. It's a little top heavy. Oh, and the little mouse thing. Let's see. Oh, and it's, oh, you can't see this, but like, so I'm just typing numbers. This isn't my passcode, so you won't know. But it works just like a regular mouse pad. How cool is that? That's pretty awesome. All right, so let me enter in my passcode. Watching the Michael Jordan documentary on YouTube TV. This is pretty cool. I mean, it's definitely a lot heavier than the previous generation one. So if you have like the iPad uh, first gen of the square version, I guess is the easiest way to say it, then it does work and it does look good. It this So let's go ahead and close it. So this is it. This is what it looks like on the back side. I'm not sure if you can see that, but it's pretty uh, easy going stuff. It is heavy. It probably, it may or may not be a little bit heavier than the MacBook Air with the iPad in it. But when you open it up, you have to use two hands. I'll be doing a full review on this later, but that's kind of what it looks like. And I'm not sure if you can see that, but that's kind of what it looks like when it's open. The trackpad is a nice size. The keyboard on them, they are definitely clickety clickety that's even a word, but it looks and feels awesome. Um, I really love the backlit display on this. I think it is something that would be extremely easy for anyone to use. Um, and without just going through a full review of it, I think it's definitely a winner. I just love how that thing floats. Like I'm turning it upside down and it's not going anywhere. It must be like some really strong magnets in those thing. Uh, I'm gonna be trying to figure out if I can put like my USB-C two terabyte SanDisk um, SSD little thing in my hard drive that I have. I'll connect to that and I'll do a full review on this soon. But this is what I got in the mail today. Uh, tank top from my sponsor, a SLR camera, and the new iPad, keypad, trackpad, first impression, opening, 
it's dope guys i would recommend it do i think it's 300 worth 300 dollars because i have the 11 inch ipad pro we'll see but i'm going to put it through its processes and kind of go through uh it all the way through so that way i can make a easier and better decision for you guys who are watching uh, but that's really it for this video. I just kind of wanted to do a couple of things that I got in the mail recently and, well, actually today, and tell you guys about them. That's it, man. You guys take care. I'll be back with a full review on the iPad and the Canon 1V. I just want to say thank you to my sponsor, Coyote Provisions, for providing this awesome sweatshirt uh, for this video. Not really a video, but just for being the sponsor of the channel. I appreciate you guys. I love you guys so much. Take care. Peace out. Be good. This hoodie is awesome. Literally, go out and buy one right away. The gray one also looks dope. Coyote Provisions, Vermont. CoyoteProvisions.com. Take care. Bye.